Hey, Mzansi, at some point in life, I keep asking myself, like, what does it really take to be a multimillionaire? It seems like you must definitely be always involved into some shitty activity. In today's video, Faith Nketsi's husband, Zuzon Chilo, was sitting in court, and guess what? Mzansi noticed something very pertinent about what brought him there. Make sure you watch this video right up to the end so that you are going to understand the exactitude of what is happening to Faith Nketsi and her husband. Before that, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, please. Like this video, drop a comment, and hit on to my post notification bell. The news of Faith Nketsi's husband, Zuzon Jilo's arrest for fraud, has taken South Africa by storm. The young businessman has been in the news for the past few days after the police issued a warrant for his arrest. Zuzo made his first appearance in court yesterday accompanied by his friend, who is also implicated in the fraud case as well. While the court was mostly empty, Mzansi was keen to know if Faith Nketsi, his wife and a well-known social media influencer, was present to support him. Nzuzu's appearance as well in court was a spectacle, with many South Africans watching the development with a bated breath. He was actually seen wearing a jacket and looking calm, despite the seriousness of the charges against him. However, many people in social media were not as calm as Nzuzu and expressed their disappointment and anger towards him and his wife. MD News actually posted, and I quote, Faith Nketsi's husband Zuzon Chilo caught appearance. This comes after Nzuzo handed himself over to the police when a warrant for his arrest was issued by the SAPs. News broke out on social media that he had left his Hyde Park. The news of Nzuzo's arrest has sparked a lot of controversy, speculations, debates, and arguments on social media with a lot of curiosity about the couple's relationship. Faith Nketsi has been dragged, insulted, and finger-pointed into the conversation, with many people asking whether she was present in court to offer emotional support to her husband, who is also the father of her child. Along the line, the court was empty, and there was no sign of faith in Ketsi, which actually pushed so many people to think negatively about her. Still, according to reports, Nzuzo and his business associate allegedly scammed and defrauded a well-known businessman in a truck deal, which is something which is highly common among you know, the scammers or the fraud stars already to an extent. The money that they obtained through the fraudulent transaction was allegedly used to fund their lavish traditional wedding ceremony, which was attended by many high-profile guests. This didn't sit so well with so many South Africans as they keep doubting all what is ongoing. I mean, the legitimacy of a source of wealth, legitimacy of Faith Nketsi's source of wealth as well. Things are going so south. You all tell me what you think about this in the comment section. I love each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart.